So you haven't had this done for a while. Is it okay if I turn your foot okay? Is it painful when I do that for your knee? No. It's okay? Yeah. All right. I just want to be sure I get everything okay. Well, it looks like it's been some time. So you said it's been a year? Yeah. Since she's had some foot care? A little over a year. Okay. How long has she been uh, with your agency now? Three or five years. Okay. I well, appreciate you bringing her in today. Yes, I like the service. I'm going to get my own times to come to. Because she said, oh, my feet feel so good in this water. <laughs> you know? Whirlpool. That's right. In the whirlpool, yeah. So this nail is pretty thick here. Has she had any uh, circulation tests done recently of her legs and feet? Mm -mm. No? Mm -hmm. That's something else we'll schedule for her as well. Okay. Because not only does... Uh... You do it here? Yes, ma'am. We do it right here. Okay. Because not only uh, does fungus cause thickening of the nails like this, but poor circulation can do it too. Okay. And given her age and everything. Yes. Born we have to check it out. Yeah, I saw that. Mm -hmm. how, old, how old are you going to be next birthday? 75. 75, all right. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay. I'm not hurting you, am I? No, sir. Okay, good. Now, given that your nails are so long and thick, is it uncomfortable for you to wear shoes, especially this time of year since it's cold? Oh. After the day, it'd be better. Hmm. <laughs> it'd be much better. It'd be better. Gotcha. But, how, but how about before today? Is it painful? <laughs> Let's hope that would be a lot better. Gotcha. It was so silent. Gotcha. So did you have any problems with your nylons on? Me? Yeah, putting your nylons on and putting your shoes on and your toes hurting or your foot hurting. Uh, I have a problem. Mm -hmm. So does she have any family in the area? Mm -hmm. No. No? I have um, my cousins mm -hmm. right here. They are in Maryland. Well, no. I, I never met any of your relatives. Mm -hmm. So how does how does how does uh she or someone like in in her situation end up with your um coming to be referred to your agency? Yeah. Um. When like if they have in, any kind of they go to the doctor and mm -hmm. any kind of anxiety or um bipolar and they are referring to us mm -hmm. um DB, they're referring to the department of behavioral health or okay. and then the behavioral health or uh, you know find a place suitable okay Because it's that, it's also, you know, all the other, all their other healthcare needs, right? Mm hmm Yeah, a little between the toes here. A little work here. It looks bad, I'm yeah. like, bad already. Yeah. Mm hmm Because we get a lot of referrals from agencies such as yourself when mm -hmm. patients are in these situations. Yeah. You know, una unable to care for their own feet. And this 
this salon told one of my clients, oh no, we're not doing anything. We, we're not even going to put color on your toenails. Mm. They seen the farmers and they told her she needed to see a podiatrist. Well, the salon did the right thing. Yeah, and she called me and said, they don't want to do my feet. And then I said, well, they don't want no lawsuit. Well, got to get it. And All she, this stuff taken care of prior to any of the uh, mm -hmm. cosmetic things. And salons that are well trained and salons that will follow procedure will do that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a beauty salon and mm -hmm. also told for the hair and also for the feet. Mm -hmm. Both salons. This little tool is called a curette. Mm -hmm. oh, so I'm going to be filing all this down shortly. I use this tool to loosen up some more of the mm -hmm. debris here. So do you need to make a, a call for your next client since we're going to be here a while? Um, I'm thinking about, because she lives right here on, where we at? She's where? on Nicholson okay. in New Hampshire. Okay. So maybe I can take her to her doctor's on um, at MedStar on mm -hmm. Irving Street and well, come back and get her. You want to run and do that? I would, if you want to do that, that'll work. Except you probably need to go do that now. Yeah, thank you, Doctor. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, I'll be back to get you. You're in good hands. Okay. Okay. So thank you. Uh, thanks for the suggestion. You're welcome.
is Kevin Jefferson, the DC Foot Doctor. Thank you very much for watching this video. Like it with a big thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. Ring the bell so you will know when a new video has been uploaded. Share it with your family and friends. If you leave a comment or a question, it may be featured in a future video. But most importantly, take care of your feet.